gets worse every night. Get in! I can't stop them all! You gotta get out of there! You guys are the ones who caused all of this! No, 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 wait! Oh, come on! The Resident Evil 3 remake has been a near certainty for a while, thanks to the excellent update of Resident Evil 2 and some leaked box art. And on Tuesday Capcom officially revealed the game with a chilling trailer during Sony's State of Play livestream. It will be out on PS4, Xbox One and PC April 3rd, 2020. The trailer fakes us out by showing footage from the second game's remake then rolling back the clock to reflect that Resident Evil 3 actually takes place 24 hours before those events. We see through Jill Valentine's eyes as deadly bioweapon nemesis stokes her from the hose of a burning building to the zombie infested streets of Raccoon City. Despite the initial first person viewpoint in the trailer mirroring Resident Evil 7, the game will be third person like the remake of 2. Resident Evil 3 Nemesis originally launched back in 1999 and quickly became a series favorite thanks to the change in gameplay and new mechanics. Following everyone's beloved Jill Valentine, the game is an absolute staple of the survival horror genre that completely deserves the remake. The game's original 1999 description reads as follows. Jill Valentine resigns from stars and vows to leave Raccoon City. She suddenly finds herself trapped by hordes of flesh-eating zombies, hideous mutants and a relentless new nemesis. Along with Resident Evil 3 you'll get co-op multiplayer game called Resident Evil Resistance, an intense 4 vs 1 survival game that had a public beta test earlier this year. One player is the mastermind who can tweak the environment and use a deck of cards to place monsters and traps, as well as taking direct control over more dangerous bioweapons like the mutated William Birkin and Tyrant. On the other side, four survivors have to work together using various weapons and unique special abilities to escape before the time runs out. Now we know the game's officially in the works. Let's hope it's just as jaw-dropping as the Resident Evil 2 remake was. So that's it from me guys, hope you enjoyed the content and if you did then I would appreciate if you leave a like or subscribe to my channel for more content like this. See you in the next one.